Hi, Marvin. How are you? How okay, are you? thank you. So, Marvin, we can start our interview. Who is Marvin Gauci? So, who is Marvin Gauci? Marvin Gauci started, uh, I started uh, my career when I was very, very young. I was uh, as young as 13 years old. Um, I started in uh, working in, uh, in a hotel and uh, from there on I, I moved on to different places um, to learn and to uh, master my ability in the kitchen. Obviously it wasn't an easy ride but uh, it had to be done. Um, uh, when I was uh, 19 I also uh, went abroad and worked abroad and uh, now we I am here uh, in Malta. I have uh, four restaurants in Malta. Um, uh, one of them is uh, Tarragon Restaurant, which was uh, uh, opened 10 years ago. And uh, three years ago, I opened Caviar and Bull in St. Julian's, where we are at right now. Um, uh, two years ago, I opened Budaman, which uh, uh, it's uh, located right on top of Caviar and Bull, and it's more Asian flavors. Um, and also uh, last year we opened uh, Dinner in the Sky Malta. Um, uh, my, um, the restaurants, all of them have a different, uh, different concept. Tarragon is more family and or, uh, familiar recipes uh, with a twist. Um, uh, but it's more like local, local fish, local um, produce and more, more into more and more into the the gastronomic side of uh, the Mediterranean. Caviar and bull is a mixture of m Mediterranean, uh, Peruvian uh, influence as well. We use a lot of uh, uh, different herbs and spices from all over the world. Um, and uh, Budaman is more uh, Asian, Asian flavors fused together and blended to a matter of uh, making something completely different. So the three restaurants are completely different concepts. And uh, the last but not the least is Dinner in the Sky, which is um, uh, a restaurant that is floating 40 meters up in the sky. And uh, the cuisine in uh, Dinner in the Sky comes from Tarragon. So Tarragon provides um, uh, the kitchen for dinner in the sky and the recipes and uh, it's Tarragon's menu okay my future my future uh, um, uh, I don't know what I'm gonna do in my future but what I know is that uh, in five weeks we opened the new restaurant Caviar and Bull in Budapest we just went international and uh, there we will uh, we will start, um, uh, well, continue uh, a brand that uh, was uh, made in Malta three years ago. Uh, the, all the, the idea from, of, of Caviar and Bull came from Tarragon because uh, after seven years, eight years of Tarragon, uh, seven and a half years of Tarragon, uh, I felt that Malta needed more restaurants like this, more central as well because Tarragon is in St. Paul's Bay, located in front of the islands, the St. Paul's Islands, in front of the sea. So, we opened Caviar and Bull. Then, we opened Budaman a year later, and a year later we opened uh, Dinner in the Sky. And a year later, after Dinner in the Sky, we're opening Caviar and Bull Budapest. So, my suggestions for uh, upcoming chefs and new chefs is uh, to follow your dreams and uh, always work with passionate people because from these people you can learn if you work with people that are not passionate and you work with people that all they think about is restaurants to make money you will not learn from these people but you will learn from people like a lot of restaurants in Malta that uh, have very good and passionate chefs and with these people you can learn and you can build your per portfolio to become a great chef. Thank you, Marvi. Thank you for your time. Thank you, Caver and Bull. I hope to see you again. So from here, I would like to thank uh, my chefs, uh, Ro uh, Roberto, my senior sous chef, and my head chef, uh, uh, Gianluca. 
I would like also to thank um, you guys for, for seeing us and following our cuisine. And the last but not the least, I would like to thank uh, Andrea Orallo and I would like to also thank uh, MoltaWebNews.com. Thank you very much.